So, Colleen, how, how exactly did you get discovered when you were down there to sing at the Opry? I mean, that's pretty prestigious. I'll try to make a long story short. I, actually, I'm a, a Detroit girl. Yeah. I'm from Detroit, Michigan, and um, I moved to Nashville in 1990 because living in Detroit, coming from a musical family and singing in bands since I was 17, I had a love for country music yep. as well as rock music, Kiss, Patsy Cline, Loretta Lynn, Led Zeppelin. It was kind of awesome. It was kind of messed up, but I, but I love the country music. And um, so in 1990, my daughter and I, uh, she was just a baby. Uh, we um, moved to Nashville, and in the first year, the first two years I lived there, I became a demo singer for publishing companies: Sony Tree, Warner Brothers, Warner Chapel. So they give you the lyrics, you'd sing it, and then artists would see if they like the songs or not. Exactly. A lot, a lot of the writers would would write the songs. And at that time, in the 90s, a lot of the popular singers were like, uh, let's say, Tanya Tucker, uh, Trisha Yearwood was just coming out, Shania Twain. And I have a, a little thing in my voice where I can impersonate a little bit, if needed. So let's say they wrote a song for Lori Morgan, even. Hey, we want to pitch this to Lori Morgan. So I would kind of feel, oh, maybe she would sing it like this, you know. Yeah. So um, I, uh, I, I did uh, demos. That was pretty much my job. And... Um, uh, Porter Wagner, uh, the uh, ambassador of the Grand Ole Opry, yep. who took Roy Acuff's place, was friends with a friend of mine, and they went out one night driving in her car to a comedy show in my cassette, 90s. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, they can't see that, can they? No, no, you <laughs> air, air, air quotes. <laughs> and uh, so, uh, and my cassette was playing in the in the cassette player and Porter said, hey, turn that up. I want to hear it. And he thought it was the radio. And um, my friend Gina says, oh, no, it's my friend Colleen Walters. And and he says, I want to meet her. And and um, she told me and I said, yeah, right. Porter Wagner. Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. From Detroit. Yeah, sure. But that's how it happens. Just yeah. the right place at the right time. It, that, that, so you got in. That's exactly it. So I actually didn't go right away. So my sister from Detroit, Patty, calls me. And she's going to love that I'm talking about her right now. Hi, Patty. <laughs> and... Um, so Patty says, hey, I want to do something different while I'm in Nashville this time. I said, well, I think I can get us backstage at the Grand Ole Opry. So we went, saw Porter. He just, the curtain just went down. He was just doing his uh, advertising for uh, Martha White Flower or Cracker Barrel or something like that. Yep. And and it was unbelievable. I, I'll never forget it. It was like 1993. When he was off the air, he said, Colleen Walters, it's about time you got here. And he gave me a big old hug. And he gave me a cassette tape of three songs that him and Dolly Parton did, because that was their career in the yep. 70s. I lived with those songs, and the following weekend, I sang in the Grand Ole Opry. Wow. Amazing. And I was there for several years. Wow. wow. <clears throat> yeah. And now you can find her at the Sailing Cow. She's going to be performing live this afternoon from 3 until whenever you stop. Yep, exactly. Is that what it happens? That's usually how it goes. <laughs> 3 <laughs> until I'm tired. The last time I was there, and I have this thing, I like doing impersonations, and yep. I, I like singing different styles of music, and I'm a I'm really big on 70s one-hit wonders. Yeah. You know, the real cheesiest bubblegum and that's songs fabulous. that people are like, what? <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember that one. So the last time we were, or, I was there, it, it was I was done, but I I wasn't right, and it was okay to keep going. Yeah. So I think I did about forty five minutes. She sang till about eight o'clock yeah. at night. Yeah, yeah. Right. I was doing stuff like Daddy was a cop. Inside <laughs> <laughs> of Chicago, you know the night Chicago died, and oh my gosh, well, little Willie Willie won't go. You probably, you These two are a show in yeah. and of themselves. So if you get off the beach today and you yes. want to be entertained, you need to head to the Sailing Cow. Please do so. Colleen Walters, Sandy as always is I, fabulous. You know what? Every time she does this, the sun comes out. And it, you guys just mentioned the sun came out. So why don't you give them a little... As oh, predicted. Which song? About Here Comes the Here Sun or something. Here comes the sun. Didn't do do. Here comes the sun. And I say, it's all right. <laughs> she comes with homemade. <laughs> it's a variety <laughs> show. This, oh, it's so... Uh, yes. <laughs> all ages. Yeah. If you want to be entertained, like I said, head on down to the Sailing Couch today, 3 o'clock. Colleen Walters. She'll play until she can't sing or play the trumpet with her mouth anymore. Yes. <laughs> yeah.